when she came back to Switzerland and had a hard time, and um, I remember we talked with uh, also Biche Koriga, who did that show in, uh, in Zurich called Frauen sind Frauen in 1975, and Heidi was involved in it. And um, Biche said that, Biche is actually coming on April 10th to talk about this. Um, and she said that uh, Heidi really much brought the, the feminist discourse from, from the US to Switzerland where uh, the women's right to vote had only been um, given, I think, seven, yeah, two years before the show. Um, do you, would you consider her a feminist? Was she, was she very vocal about that? Actually not. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's, uh, I think more in terms of my personal life and uh, the relationship uh, she had with Karl Bucher. And, and of course that, uh, let's say that problematic, as you mentioned before, two artists and, and one being much more visible in, in, uh, in, in the public, but also in the art world. And she had very strong uh, opinions about that. But I think, uh, yeah, and, and obviously she's from that generation of women who had, had to deal with it in a totally uh, different way as, uh, as, we see it, uh, as we experience it today. And she was a, she was a feminist in that sense, but she would not uh, she would not uh, it would not be uh, a very strong um, part of her conversations really. But the work itself, of course, brings up a lot of themes. Uh, um, artists who are being called feminist artists uh, share, you know, and the, the early performances with the objects, um, the the body shells, and, and also the, the the, you know the, the thematic of of um, of the surface, the clothes, was a, was a feminist approach traceable there. Mm -hmm. 